Our today's topic is how to find GCD of three number. We want to design algorithm for finding GCD of three number. GCD and SCF both are same. Highest common factor and greatest common divisor meaning are same. So let us, with the help of example, we under, try, try to understand what is the meaning of GCD. Suppose 3 is a value, 6 is a value and 12 is a value. What we want to do? We want to find the GCD of 3, 6 and 12. What is the meaning of this GCD? This 3 can be divisible by 1, it can be divisible by 3. 6 can be divisible by 1, it can be divisible by 2 and it can be divisible by 3. And 12, 12 can be divisible by 1, it can be divisible by 2, it can be divisible by 3 and it can be divisible by 4 also. Now, among these 3 value, among these 4 value and between this, this 2 value, which one is the common, this 3 is the common, here is the 3 common, here is the 3 common. Now, this 3 is the GCD of 3, 6 and 12. What is the meaning of this? 3 can be divided 3, 3 can be divided 6, 3 can be divided 12 and that is why it is common for all, that is why it is GCD, okay. Is it clear? So now, how to design algorithm? This is our question is to design algorithm. <coughs> Assuming a is a variable, B is a variable, C is a variable and GCD is a variable where after calculate, calculating GCD we want to store the output in GCD variable. Assuming A having 3 value, B having 6 value and C having 12 value. Is it okay? No. Before Finding GCD, what we need to do, we need to find the largest number among three numbers. Which one is the largest? How to find it? With the help of conditional operator, we can find it. Now, if A is greater than B, then the control will come after question mark. Otherwise, control will come after column. This is the work of conditional operator. Now, if it is true, then we are having another confusion whether A is greater than C or not. If A is greater than C, then A will be written, otherwise C will be written. If A is greater than B, then do this. Otherwise, if it is false, control will come here, means B is greater. If B is greater, then B, whether B is greater than C or not. If B is greater, then B will be written, otherwise C will be written. Now, we are having here the largest value among these three value in the GCD. According to this example, largest value is 12. Now apply the loop. While A divided remainder GCD not equal to 0. Or operator B remainder GCD not equal to 0. Or operator C remainder GCD not equal to 0. Here we are binding three conditions with the help of or, or operator. First condition is this, condi second condition is this, and third condition is this. So we are binding three condition here with the help of or operator. If any one condition is true, this while will execute. Now, A having how much? It is having 3 and GCD having 12. Here 6, B having 6 and GCD is 12. C is how much? 12 and 12. 12 remainder 12, it is 0. This condition is false. The C, 6 remainder 12, remainder is 6. 6 not equal to 0, it is true. This is also true. If any one condition is true, loop will execute. Now, GCD. Minus, minus. While we are decrementing this GCD, it will become 11. Now this condition is true. 
If this condition is true, again it will dec decrease 10. Again, 3 by 10, remainder is 3. How much? If this condition is, this condition is true, it means this is the decrement, it is 9. For the 9, it is also true. It will decrease, decrease. It, it, it will decrease by 1, 8. 3 by 8, how much? Remainder is 3. It will decrease 7. 3 by 7, remainder is 3 again. It is true. It will decrement 6. Now, 3 by 6, again, remainder is 3. 5. 3 by 5, again, remainder is 3. Condition is true. It will execute, decrease it. 4. 4, 4, 3 by 4, can, can, uh, 3 by 4, remainder is 3 again. Now, it will decrease 3. Now, when the GCD is 3, when the GCD is 3, 3 remainder 3, 0. 0 is not equal to 0, condition false. 6 by 3, remainder is 0. 0 is not equal to 0, condition is false. 12 by 3, remainder is 0. 0 not equal to 0, condition is false. This all condition are false. When all the condition are false, this while loop stop its, its execution. Where is the output? Output is in GCD. Printer. Now, with the help of this logic, you can design the algorithm, you can design also the function. Okay. Later on we will discuss about the function. But this is the logic for finding GCD of three number. You try to implement it. It's very simple. Okay, you try to implement it with the help of any language whether you are using C, C++ or Java. Okay, in every language this condition operator there. Implement it. 